for another video of uh, this amplifier uh, this uh, the range uh, from 10 megahertz to uh, 20 gigahertz you can see that the peak here right now is showing 21.6 here so along the way mostly it's about 20 dBm then drop about at about uh, 15 uh, gigahertz drop out to about 15 dBm the input is 0 dBm and this is the second video the one, first one was 26.5 to 31.9 gigahertz and this is from the start to uh, let's do the start actually we'll start do a stop frequency of let's say 3 uh, gigahertz and start uh, 10 megahertz so this is 10 megahertz up to 2.9 gigahertz this is the band of the spectrum specifically and the peak here is 21.6 as you can see here so it's uh, really start low at about 10 megahertz and going up to 31.7 uh, gigahertz very very wide range amplifier and now it's working this this point is a minus 5 volt it's about 10 milliamps and 6 volt at 270 milliamps so you got minus this is a negative voltage so you need to put the positive to the ground here and the negative is going to this you need to connect this first and then add to this fi 5 volts here I put 6 volts it's okay it's permitted by, by the manufacturer up to 7 volt actually maximum so if I push it a little more may bring and provide more output power so put here 6 volts and 270 milliamps so it's getting hot a little bit you need to connect it to uh, attach a heatsink to this amplifier thank you